Hans Schweiger is is not an artist that that achieved any fame, but he did create one of the most powerful images in the entire series. And the the key is in the title, which is The Hunt. Because normally, yeah, you would look at this and it's like, okay, you've got this Buddha imagery. You've got, I'm not completely sure if the figure on his right is meant to be kind of like an Ishtar. You've obviously got death on his left. But what you do have, like what I, I do know, is just when you're looking at it, you've got all of these people being swept up as as victims of commerce. And so something that that is is relevant to this on a chronological sense is this is right after the Industrial Revolution. And the reason that we even have Art Nouveau is because the artists were reacting to the idea that industrialization was going to ruin our society. And so when you look at the factory that's in the background, we take that for granted, big factories like that. That did not exist in 1895. And so I saw the comment come up, like, is it life or death? Like, I would say that, uh, I would say yes. I would say that what he's trying to do here is making the point that by pursuing these material goods, uh, I mean, in a cliche way, pursuing the material goods, you know, you've got you've got industry and commerce that you're losing life. But I think that there's another element to this, um, which might be a little more critical, something that was really, really prominent in German illustration at this time, were uh, everything like this um, was very highly politically charged. I shouldn't say everything, but I mean, like a lot of this kind of material was. And so I do think that um, the idea that spiritualism is becoming corrupt is probably a big element of it. 